all right guys as i as we discussed earlier that uh, this is the resistance line around one five uh three eight zero three eight zero this is the resistance line according to a fibonacci extension and we are expecting that price will give a correction from this area so we have given two level one is a one uh, 38 percent extension and another 161 percent extension uh, this one and uh, this one is 138 this uh, this is the resistance line so we are expecting that price will give a correction now if you want to see the previous market behavior and the price are bouncing off uh, this one 50 moving average have you seen and the 20 moving average and another 100 moving average so three moving average we are we have seen uh, price are respecting one is 20 exponential another 50 exponential and another 100 so three uh, moving average they are act as a support now exactly price are near in this area uh, this is the 20 exponential moving average uh, we are looking for buy if uh, they form any buy signal in a small time frame for intraday so let me draw a horizontal line by connecting this level now i can see price just here i can see we have seen there uh 1500 15000 all right Not act as a support now somewhere there have you seen act as a support now let's just jump to a small time frame like uh, 15 minute okay now here you can see price just near this uh, supporting line and in this area uh, you can see according to the price action method they are creating lower low lower high lower low lower high now question is that it is going to diverge from this area or it will continue the toward the uh, downside so that is the important okay let's see first uh, is it there any diverging according to rsi so we haven't seen any divergence somewhere there all right price are creating lower low and uh, there are no divergence so it is a probability to continue toward the downside and our next supporting level is uh, somewhere okay near moving average of uh, 50 because this 50 line are expecting recently have you seen means we are looking for buy uh, in this area so if price continue to draw toward the downside we are looking for short somewhere there all right but sometime what happened price not able to create a divergence and again price will uh, just uh, continue to add upside so at that time what we will do so let me draw a horizontal line by connecting this point so now you can see i just connected most of the recent swing point swing point swing point swing point swing point swing point and a swing point so we are looking for buy after breaking this level so at the level of 1520 that is our raise 10 line so once price breaks so definitely i'll go for buy and next target will be 15380 that that is my target so almost previous higher point now let's see some top uh, gainer stocks uh, today uh, first here you can see this one ONGC let's just jump to ONGC ONGC okay this one ONGC uh, let's see uh, daily time frame In the daily time frame ONGC just broke this raise 10 line have you seen this one of raise 10 line price broke this raise 10 line somewhere there and the price are too far from moving average now you can see this area so we need a pullback so once price pull back to this level so we are looking for buy but in this area i'm not interested to take any buy position so let's see in a small time frame uh it should look like different yeah now i can see uh here you can see according to market behavior they're bouncing off moving average 50 have you seen they're bouncing off 50 somewhere they're 50. so means i'm looking for buy above 104 and there are 50 moving average and i'm looking for buy after giving a confirmation somewhere there above 104 so it will be around 108 that will be my buy opportunity in ongc 
and the next one let's see uh, next one gale okay gale all right this one gale first let's see in a daily time frame and the price exactly near this resistance line so here we see it price broke and today just close above this resistance line now you can see 15 minute exactly price pull back toward the resistance line now it's becoming a support price break this resistance line somewhere there and pull pull back and that is our buy opportunity so uh, around one four four so that that is our buy opportunity all right we we everybody knows that once price break this resistance line always pull back and th that is our buy opportunity like that somewhere there and it's a probability to continue toward the upside so it's a buy opportunity okay next one bpcl okay bpcl okay this one bpcl see in the daily time frame all right okay this one uh, the, this is a very strong resistance somewhere there have you seen multiple rejection point somewhere there rejection hit, price hit and reverse back hit and reverse back hit and reverse back and a hit and reverse back so we have seen multiple rejection we are looking for buy after breaking this area so let's uh, jump to in a small time frame all right here i can see 15 minute time frame price broke and in a small time frame price are running in an uptrend they are bouncing up 20 20 and it is a probability to pull back to this level and that that is our buy opportunity so we have seen most of uh, most of the time we have seen buy opportunity and another one let's see what is okay iocl uh, this one another iocl okay iocl jump to daily time frame all right now i can see this is the another buy opportunity in iocl Mm, price are running in between these ranges, and the, let me draw a market range somewhere there. This is the range. Okay, this is the actual market range. Price are running in between these ranges. Have you seen? And exactly price near the supporting line, and we are looking for buy. And next target would be around one zero uh, nine. Uh, that is our target now you can see that is our buy opportunity now let's just jump to small time frame in a 15 minute now you can see uh, this is the actually our buy opportunity uh, price broke this 200 moving average create a new high and pull back and buy opportunity and another one ntpc Can let me remove this one daily time frame. Let me remove this one NTPC. Okay, NTPC this one mm, daily time frame NTPC and the price broke this diagonal uh, trend line somewhere there. Have you seen? Price was creating lower, lower, lower high lower low and the price broke this area so in that case you can see this is the resistance line let me draw this resistance line somewhere there and let's jump to 15 minute price exactly near this resistance line and we need a breakout so in that case we'll use breakout trading strategy in ntpc so last one let's see uh call india okay last one call india call india call india okay this one one jump to daily time frame okay call india here you can see they still running a sideway and this is the actual market range somewhere there this is the actual market range and this is the actual market range 
so we are expecting that price will hit this resistance line and we are looking for buy somewhere there all right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching